Okay, I wanted to start with this song tonight because um, I played it at Whitetail and I had brain freeze <laughs> and I didn't make it through the song. Uh, it's good riddance by Green Day. And this is not really the Green Day version, this is the uh, Tim Hawkins version. And it's called Things You Do Not Say to Your Wife. dress you're wearing reminds me of my own girlfriend. Where did you get those shoes? I think they're pretty lame. Please stop talking because I'm trying to watch the game. Now if you are the kind of man who wants to live a long and happy life, these are things that you don't say to your wife. trip next week on your birthday. I didn't ask you because I knew it'd be okay. Now go make supper while I watch this fishing show. I'm taping over our old wedding video. Now if you are the kind of man who wants to live a long and happy life, these are things that you don't say to your wife. Your cookie's pretty good, but not like mother makes. That diamond in the ring I bought you is a fake. Your eyes look puppy dear, are you feeling ill? Happy anniversary, I bought you a treadmill. Now if you are the kind of man does not want to get stabbed with a big knife, these are things that you don't say to your wife. I memorized all the lyrics finally. Okay. Okay. Uh, this next one is by Rodney Carrington. And it's called, there's no kids here, right? All the kids went home. Okay. Uh, it's called, There She Goes, She's Pitching Again. Dangerous up here. There she goes, she's bitching again, saying the things she's heard from all her friends. It don't matter what I do, where the hell I've been, there she goes, bitching again. I could make a million dollars, put it in her purse, buy a big old mansion, you know, but things would just get worse. Lasso her to the moon, put it with her stuff. But she'd want to know where was Neptune, cause the moon ain't good enough. There she goes, bitching again. Saying the things she's heard from all her friends. It don't matter what I do, where the hell I've been. There she goes, bitching again. I could paint the Sistine Chapel. Or win the Nobel Prize I could build the wall of China That'd be nothing in her eyes I could write the whole dang Bible Read it to her twice Well, she'd want to know why the yard ain't mowed And the fridge don't make no ice There she goes Bitching again Saying the things she's heard from all her friends It don't matter what I do where the hell I've been, there she goes, bitching again. Now, that's not fair to the ladies, I know. So, Rodney didn't cover the guys, you know, so I thought I'd better add a little bit. This is about how when a pretty girl walks by, all the blood goes out of a guy's head and out of his brain, and it goes down into his erection. Oh, come on, here we go. And it's called, Here He Goes, He's Brain Dead Again. Okay. Here he goes, brain dead again. All his blood ran down to his penis head. Pretty girl walks by, 
that stands up nice and high There he goes, brain dead again Well, his clothes could be on fire He could be sinking in quicksand One arm in a cast, he just use his other hand He could be on his deathbed With one last request and you want the nurse to touch it and can he see her breast? There he goes, brain dead again. All the blood has run down from his head. A pretty girl walks by and the moon can fall from the sky. There he goes, brain dead again. Okay, I'll work on that a little bit. I <laughs> think not getting a very good reaction so far. Uh, this one is um, this is an old Gary Lewis and the Playboys, 1966, called "Save Your Heart for Me." Let's see. This is uh, Take Good Care of My Baby, Bobby Vinton, 1961. I know she wouldn't 
be with you Take good care of my baby I don't want to be as kind as you can be And if you should discover that you don't really love her Just send my baby back home That's okay for 1961. This isn't 1961. You know, you can't have your lover go out there and sleep around with every Tom and Harry, Dick in the neighborhood. There's diseases out there. That guy gave something to my baby. My baby brought it home to me. And as I soon discovered, she contracted from her lover some really itchy STD. Okay, thank you for your.